What's up guys, Epic John Tazan here and we have a new product from Hobby NRC. Uh, it is the SG700 quadcopter. And before we unbox this thing, let's go over a couple of things. Uh, first and foremost, it is a fold-up drone, so it's easy to take with you when you're traveling. And judging by the weight of this box, the drone is fairly light. Uh, and I'm going to be super curious to see how it's going to hold up in the wind. Because uh, from my experience, the lighter weight drones tend to drift with the wind because it's just so light. Um, but going through the box here on the top here, it's got a couple of features that I guess we can talk about. Uh, it's got speed control, Wi-Fi FPV camera, uh, Wi-Fi connection, LED lights, smartphone control, altitude hold, headless mode, uh, one key taking off, which I guess is a button that auto takes off and auto lands. Um, actually, maybe not land. Oh yeah, there you go. Auto, uh, one key take off, one key landing. So auto take off and auto land. Uh, it's, it's got gyroscopes, uh, 360 degree flip, and an auto home, uh, which is weird. It's so, I'm, oh, here we go. It says here it uses optical flow positioning, which I guess it detects uh, where it takes off, uh, and then it go, knows to go back where it's going to land, which would be interesting, and I don't know if I'm going to try it because uh, this thing does not have GPS, so if you take off far, how the hell is it going to know where to come back to? Uh, but it'll be interesting to see. And then one more thing is, uh, this looks like to be the remote control, so it has a uh, little thing here for you to hold your cell phone, I guess, while you're flying FPV. Uh, but that'll be interesting to check out. Before you get started, your remote uh, it folds out like this to hold your phone. And in the back, it takes two AAA batteries. So I'm going to throw that in there right now, just to power the remote. And I think I just turned it on. Um, but also to uh, power the drone, uh, there's a little battery back here underneath, and that just really slides out and it's USB rechargeable, which is provided to you uh, in the box. So you're probably gonna have to charge that for a little bit. That slides right back in. And then I have here in the app, it's uh, XA UFO. That's the app that we're gonna be using. Um, and so now it's asking me to pair, so I'm gonna try and pair it. Okay, so right now I have it uh, set to the Wi-Fi. Uh, unfortunately, it's not letting me connect. So we're gonna go ahead and fly without it and see how it performs. Uh, I'm just going to use the remote here that they provided, which I guess you got to be a little more aggressive with it because it's made out of plastic. Um, but here we go. Okay, so now that we're uh, outside, uh, we're gonna take the drone up again, now that we have a little bit more room. Uh, again, I'm gonna be interested to see uh, how this is gonna hold up in the wind, because it's a little bit windy out. Uh, that being, it's so lightweight. Uh, I still was not able to connect to the app, so we're just gonna fly it freehand. Uh, but hopefully, we'll be able to try it again later and see uh, if it connects.
So there you have it, the ZL drone from Hobby NRC. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it educational. I still was not able to connect to the app, so just flying it freehand, you saw I was able to do the 360 maneuver, uh, which was really cool. Uh, it was super lightweight, so I wouldn't advise you flying this in high winds, because uh, it tended to drift or I'd have to fight it uh, coming back. And when I hit that button, it took like a two second delay. So I wasn't sure whether it would be able to maneuver and then come back to me at the same time. Uh, as, as well, I was not able to do the auto land or auto takeoff because I did not want it to fly out and just crash into something. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys found this video educational. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Other than that, I'll catch you guys on the next video. See ya! Thank you.